This tutorial explains how to use the Easy Clip module. First, open the model in 3D Slicer, shown here utilizing the drag and drop method. Click OK. Choose the area you want to crop. In this tutorial, we crop the right condyle. To access the Easy Clip module, you can use the search tool, which is the little magnifying glass next to the module's toolbar. Type Easy Clip and select it. The model you want to crop should appear here. Click Compute Bounding Box around all models from the toolbar on the left. To center the model, you can click the little target icon in the upper left corner of the workspace. Next, click the check marks on the left depending on which planes you want to crop. Red is the axial plane, yellow is the sagittal plane, and green is the coronal plane. You can use all three at once by selecting them all or use one at a time. You can move the planes up and down to one side or the other and anterior posteriorly. You can also move the angulation. The part that is cropped is based upon the arrows oriented on the model. For the red axial plane, the condyle is on the top arrow, so make sure the bullet for keep top arrow is selected. For the yellow plane, the condyle is also in the top arrow region, so select keep top arrow. For the green one, the condyle is on the down arrow side, so select keep down arrow. Once this is set how you like, click the clipping icon on the left toolbar. Here, it is clipped where intended, but if that doesn't occur, you can always click undo. Another tool is moving the angulation of the cropping plane. Leaving only one plane selected, we hover over the line with the arrow. It turns red, and when it does, you can move the plane accordingly to the angulation you desire. When you click back in the general area of the plane, you can now drag this plane according to the new angulation. You can position the plane however you intend. To move the plane without moving the angulation, you must see the pin. You can then use the yellow to separate the right side from the left side. Here, we chose the top arrow on both and cropped the condyle in this manner.